Social media is a way to form a community really fast. I have, uh, you've heard of Twitter. I'm currently at around, I think it's 27, or sorry, no, 37,000 followers on Twitter because of the community that I've built with my internet marketing know-how and I share my experiences, whether it's by video or written. And on top of that, I also give out massive content and value to people so that they can learn and that's why they share my content all the time. So that's how I built that. So as a realtor, how does that work out for you? Well, you need to be sharing your insight about the market because there's always, I think, there's three things that the buyer or the seller wants. They want to know how much their house is worth. They want to know um, what's available on the market. And then on top of that, they wanted to see the neighborhood and area where it's in. So it's, uh, I'm not too familiar with the commercial side of things, but that's more residential. So by, by going onto a site like Twitter, or even the Facebook where your friend shared that article, she's kind of showing that she keeps up to date with all the, the uh, uh, I'm gonna say the, the knowledge that's available on the web, is you wanna stay up to date with it. And there's a tool, if you write this down, it's called Google Alerts. You I just did right? a video, oh, I just yeah. did a video. And it's oh, walking in front of the protector again. <laughs> uh, it's called Google Alerts, and what it can do is it can track your keywords. So, for instance, one of your keywords is Marina Del Rey real estate. And there's probably like 30,000, 40,000 people that search for that every month. So, one of the things that you want to do as an individual is you want to stay up to date with what people are posting in your niche or in your market. And on top of that is not only follow up with it, but you also may want to comment on it. Like if you have an opinion on what they posted, and you can see where the time is starting to come in. This takes time to read stuff, watch the videos, and get the content going, right? So that's, that's the tool that I rec would recommend. And when you put in a keyword, what it will do is it will send you everything that comes up in that topic. Uh, the other cool thing is you have your Facebook stuff. You have a Facebook profile. If you're not aware, there's also fa Facebook fan pages. And that's where you're, you can really build in your, like, your brand. You'll, you'll find that there's more and more companies coming with Facebook fan pages. All this is kind of like a business page. And uh, I would recommend getting that started for yourself too. You can go to facebook.com forward slash pages. And then that will get, get you started there. Um, 